So now, I'm getting really tired now. Um, it's half past six, so we've been up just over 12 hours now. Um, and we have come to Valencia train station. Now we booked our tickets from Valencia to Alicante. Um, the comfort seat, no premium seats. And as uh, so we've walked in to the station, we're about half an hour early, um, we saw a sign for the lounge. We hadn't actually looked into that, whether our tickets get us the lounge or not. And um, yeah, lucky enough, uh, they did. So we went into the ticket office, just said, do they? They said yes. Um, walked through again, having to show our, um, our double vaccinated passport. Um, and our passports. Um, yeah, then we've come in, and then I'll show you around in a moment. But there's a range of tea, coffees, um, orange juices, um, soft drinks, a couple of beers. Um, what's your one called? Yellow Cab. There's a Yellow Cab one. And then bar, uh, beer, there's alcohol free beer. Um, in fact, I just said fruit juices. Um, yeah, so. It's all in with our tickets, so that was a that was a nice little bonus. And we're sitting in comfy chair. I can't really see them. There you go. We're sitting in lovely comfy chairs. I'm so tired now. Um, and then we've got a two-hour journey into Alicante, and then we'll go to bed. But uh, yeah, before that, I'll show you around. I might as well do that now. Too. Get my mask. So here we go. So from where we're sitting, we can see our train. It's a little Christmas tree. Got the choice in the fridge and sanitizer. selection of drinks there and then I'll take you up the staircase it's nice sitting there chilling That space up here is quite nice, especially if you need to uh, work, a couple of meeting rooms. It's probably exactly the same in the fridge. A few more. A couple of chairs over there. Yeah, so if you uh, do pay for Oh, walking down the wrong bit. There we go. <laughs> if you do pay for um, premium, um, you actually get the lounge as well. So, uh, yeah, definitely worth it. Especially if you've been like us and uh, travelling around. And this is the end part of your journey. I'm going to sit down and chill. See you on the train. Right, so now I said that we were on our um, way to Alicante. <laughs> our train was meant to be at seven o'clock. I don't know why I'm laughing. It's probably not actually funny at all. Um, we've boarded the train. It's nearly eight o'clock. Um, and we've just had an announcement that the train is not going to be leaving here until nine, what was it, 25? Until 9.25. Um, it was all in Spanish, so we've asked um, someone on the train to translate to us yeah and um yeah their response was we are f and you can imagine what the other uh, letters were so um yeah we're quite lucky i suppose that we haven't got anywhere to go once we get to alicante um we probably would just will be heading back to the apartment so now we're just going to be sitting um in valencia we could have stayed in the uh 
could have stayed in the lounge. We had like free teas and coffee, yeah. <laughs> beer and juices. Um, yeah, so it's going to be a long wait. I think I'm going to get my headphones out and I'm going to see if this movie is um, in English. <laughs> and if it is, I'll be watching that. So a very long day. I'll yeah, keep you updated. <laughs> so, um, one of the Spanish guys on here was just spoken to um, one of the engineers and just said, um, he translated and then uh, and I said, oh, I apologise, it's not 9.25, it's 8.25, which is still like an hour and 25 minutes late, but um, like I say, they did email us in advance. We did have the lounge, so that was good. And um, yeah, that was, uh, yeah, it was quite funny. <laughs> they were, uh, everyone just seems to be in quite good spirits still, though. It must be because it's Christmas Eve. Um, yeah. Uh, right, just 25 minutes to wait until we depart. So now I've just been given some, oh, some earphones. They come in a little box. And then plug them into. I don't know if I have some There we go. And here we have different channels. I can turn the volume up and down. I did think these. I did think that they were connected to um, the TV, but since I put them in, the TV's gone off, so I don't know. Um, listening to some music at the moment um still not it's been about 20 minutes now and we're still not um, oh some information's now coming through Atención, señores viajeros les informamos que debido a causas técnicas la salida del tren está prevista para las 9 menos 25 gracias por su atención y disculpen la molesto I've got someone what that was translated to. Um, yeah, that's quite good because the information will come, the music stops and the information comes through. So that's quite good. Um, still not on our way. And um, nothing serious apart from these seats are quite comfy. And we've still got a drink from our lounge. So um, yeah, very tired. I'm just waiting to uh, head off and when we head off we actually have something to eat as well which by now I am very very hungry so I'm listening to some music and read a book um, a little tray of food I might have got the sandwich there um, I've eaten mine I forgot that I was meant to film and show you um, but yeah it was just two that was chicken and there we go so if you can speak Spanish, oh, what was in those? No, polo, chicken. Yeah, this had like a cream, I think it was like a fish. Then you get a little red velvet cake. I haven't tried that yet. And yeah, all fresh stuff. And there was a chocolate in there or some type of sweet. You also get two drinks, so. I've chosen two carvers, as it's a two hour, I chose two beers, and um, yeah, we're gonna uh, might read a bit of my book, we're just gonna enjoy the rest of the journey now, and um, I'll see you in Alicante. So we have just got off of our train um yeah considering we had the uh the delays um paying premium was so worth it i mean we didn't know we had to pay i think it was about um 30 euros more we yeah the, the i mean we were traveling late on christmas eve so you can imagine it's not the uh busiest time probably there was lots of daytime ones that were more expensive so we opted to pay the extra for the train and that worked out really well um, because they did email us a couple of days ago and um, say that there'd been a theft 
which will cause the fire um, that closer as if you're heading more towards um, Barcelona but that caused a problem with these trains um, because of the line that we were on so um, yeah we were lucky that we were able to go and sit in the lounge we had had a really long day if you were like if you um, were just in Valencia and you weren't relying on train um, sorry on flights on meeting people and things like that on Christmas Eve I'm just gonna move over because there's a little cart coming along yeah then uh, it was fine and actually the bigger picture of stuff for us we wasn't meeting anyone it wasn't that bad the fact we had the lounge we could sit somewhere warm was great then when we got on the train there was further delays slightly frustrating but as well because we had the premium we got some food um, a few drinks so um, yeah that was fine and actually the journey if you were to ask would I do it again yeah I would if it was a really cheap flight going into Valencia and I could sort of spend the afternoon there the only problem is we're carrying our cases around now so I'll probably only do it if I was just carrying just a small bag <laughs> and now Martin's just said because of the time of this train that's coming we're probably going to miss the last tram so that's just going to cost us a bit more and we'll have to pay for a taxi um, to the apartment but uh, I'm going to turn you around now again there's not many people around so that's good again the people you do see wearing their masks which is actually what you want um, again people who are meeting people um, wearing masks so yeah it's, um, it's feeling very safe and it's Christmas Eve so I'm going to oh look there's some other down there some other Christmas Eve people just like me but it's Christmas Eve so I'm gonna go I'm gonna go what, what, what's the time now Mark 20 past 10 20 past 10 um, so a bit earlier than what we were expecting these dogs are so cute check out that little that little beauty and then there's one there yeah very very cute happy christmas everybody and um we'll see you tomorrow for christmas dinner